Hi, I'm Steve Bromberg, President of Canadian Coin and Currency. This is one of my very favorite times of the month. As Canada's largest distributor for the Royal Canadian Mint, we get in advanced samples of all of the new products, or at least as many of them as are ready for delivery. And today I'm going to showcase for you the new September 2020 releases. One of the new releases for September 2020 is actually two different products. They're both original mint rolls, uh, which showcase commemorative coins marking the 75th anniversary of the Second World War. Now, there have been some other commemoratives for the anniversary of the Second World War and the beginning of peace, but these ones are really cool the way that they've been done. First of all, you can choose between a colored roll or a classic roll. The colored roll to me is a little bit cooler, but as a collectible, the classic engraved roll is much rarer. And I'm gonna explain. Let me showcase for you the individual coins. Here is what the coins look like from the colored roll. The V for victory first appeared, and I'm gonna actually sneak this into the picture for a moment. It doesn't come with your roll, but here's an original 1945 five cent coin with the V for victory on it. This was in circulation through the last three years of the Second World War. Now, that design has been taken and colorized and made part of our new toonie. The colorized rolls, 25 coins per roll, new for 2020. Uh, the colorized rolls are going to have a mintage of 15,000. Now, if you want the scarce one, the classic engraved rolls have a mintage of only 5,000. For me personally, one of each, but it's really up to you which you prefer. But cool, interesting, uh, affordable history from the Royal Canadian Mint. One of my favorite things that I love to see from the Royal Canadian Mint is when they really stretch the envelope and move technology forward in a way that gives you a really cool effect. And this is one that's been done extremely well. This is the Bald Eagle. Now it's not just a Bald Eagle because the Royal Canadian Mint has done several Bald Eagle coins before. What's cool about this one is the ultra high relief. It's about six millimeters above the surface of the coin. It's a one ounce pure silver $25 coin. It's GST, HST exempt. But the real thing about this is the ultra high relief on it. This is going to be one that sells out very quickly from the mint and one that I highly recommend. One of my favorite things that I love to see on coins from the Royal Canadian Mint is when there's an amazing story to be told, and especially when the story is really well told. Well, this particular coin, and I'm just showing you some images first, which are the actual reference photos that were used for engraving this coin. Here's the front, here is the back. This is the SS Kiwatan. The SS Kiwatan is a ship that was part of the CPR uh, ship line that carried thousands of immigrants from Port McNichol to uh, what is now Thunder Bay. The ship is really cool because the ship is the baby sister of the Titanic. It was built at the same shipyard as the Titanic. This is a two ounce pure silver coin. The mintage is only 3,000 on it. It is interesting, it is innovative, it is extremely well done. You've got to see the two images, the, um, the front and the back of this ship, the uh, bow and the port side, the, uh, the bow and the stern rather for this. This is your chance to capture some really cool history. It's large format, it's low mintage, everything that I think uh, a great coin should be. Two years ago, the Royal Canadian Mint really stepped it up with some 
Cool innovation in moving coins, moving parts to the coins. Well, here it is, September 2020, and there's a new edition of the series. I'm gonna showcase it for you, but first I just wanna show you the original 2018 coin. This was the carousel coin. It was originally issued about the same price as the new issue that we're gonna do, but the price for this has gone way up. It's more than doubled in the market, in market value uh, since it was first issued. This was the carousel. Well, the newest one, is the hummingbird and let me just open this up and showcase for you what this is going to look like same concept same format same presentation it's absolutely beautiful it's got a dome over the top and this uses gravity to move now there's something really special about hummingbirds hummingbirds are magical hummingbirds are these tiny amazing birds that can hover in one place they cross pollinate flowers for us and here is the hummingbird on the zinnia flower let me take one of these out completely out of the packaging for you for a moment this is five ounces of pure silver for the base coin and then it is silver which is yellow gold plated for the hummingbird and silver which is rose gold plated for the zinnia flower one of my absolute number one picks from the royal canadian mint for the entire year this is fun this is interesting it is beautiful art and it's one that i expect to appreciate and value in the secondary market if you want to get in on this one uh, you can go ahead and place your order while they're available but i recommend not waiting too long for this one If you're at all like me, one of the reasons that you collect coins is because you love history. And to me, I find the history of our country fascinating, but not just the history itself, it's the art and images from an era gone by. And this huge one kilo coin that we're about to showcase for you, new release from the Royal Canadian Mint, takes some beautiful artwork from about 120 years ago that was originally on a postcard with the coat of arms of Canada back at a time when there were only seven provinces and it transforms it into a modern adaption of that and it's a one kilogram coin that's over 32 ounces of pure silver i love with these premium coins the packaging the presentation from the royal canadian mint beautiful wood case for it embossed with the mint logo on the front but it's all about the coin itself and here it is fabulous quality beautiful imagery i'm going to take one of these out of the packaging to show you up close for a moment it's a coat of arms of canada kind of reimagined as it was back uh, at the turn of the century. It is uh, substantial. Let me just bring a toonie into the picture here for a moment, just to give you a little idea of the size of this. It is huge. It is uh, just an impressive piece that captures Canadian history, the arms of our country with the different provinces. Now you'll see the four different provinces on the outside represented. They are the four founding provinces of Canada, Ontario, Quebec, Nova Scotia, and New Brunswick. And then you've got the additional provinces that are pre-1905 added to the center coat of arms. Mintage on this, only 600 coins for the entire country. If you want something that is really scarce, interesting, historic, I think that this one is worthy of consideration. So these are the first six of the new launches for September 2020 from the Royal Canadian Mint. There's some very cool stuff here, interesting things to see and to add to your collection. However, there are another five or six items that the samples have not arrived yet. They are, however, available on our website at cdncoin.com. You'll also find about 30,000 more items available if you want to check through historic collector coins and older issues from the Royal Canadian Mint. Of course, when you shop with us at cdncoin.com, we offer all of the new items from the Royal Canadian Mint together with the historic coins and your opportunity to collect collector credits, which give you some special values that you won't find anywhere else. Thanks for joining us and have a great time collecting. Mm -hmm.